It's that time of year again. There's a nip in the air, a spring in most people's steps, and lots of pretty decorations and lights for us to enjoy. Some of those decorations and lights have already been up for quite some time. Some might even say they've been up for too long. There is a holiday between Halloween and Christmas after all. All you people who put up Christmas lights before Thanksgiving, I'm looking at you. But that's neither here nor there, and that's not exactly the holiday trend I want to talk to you about today. I do want to talk about holidays, but I want to specifically focus on what happens to recruiting costs during the holiday season. I'm talking costs for leads and hires here. What happens? Is it more expensive, less expensive? Are there any trends we can uncover to help you more effectively budget and spend to get drivers during this time of year? Well, as it turns out, We'll get to that in one minute, but first, if you like our videos, like the recruiting roundup here, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you never miss a new episode of this or any of our other video content. You can also find all our videos in the talent resources section over on the Randall Riley site, where you can also sign up to be a part of our email newsletter. And finally, if today's data-heavy topic is something that really tickles your fancy, might I suggest you check out Strategize? The Strategize module of Stratus was built to help you dig into the data to minimize hiring costs and allow you to effectively target the best locations for your recruiting. That sounds like something you'd be into? Get in touch with us. Schedule a demo today. If you're watching on the Randall Riley site, you can click somewhere over here. And if you're over on YouTube, I'll leave a link for you down in the description below. For Randall Riley, I'm Joshua Miller. This is my layer, and you are watching the Recruiting Roundup. Now, back to why you're all here. The holiday hiring cost data. Now we got a great team here that just loves to dig into the numbers to find all the nuances and come up with any competitive advantages they can for our partners. That's you. So our data gurus crunched those numbers and took a look at the past several years, 2018 through 2021 to be more exact, and examined the cost per lead and cost per hire data in general and then compared those costs to the holiday seasons of those years to find out if there was a noticeable difference from early November through the end of December and the holiday season when compared to the rest of the year. Now. Before we get to the numbers themselves, just so we're all on the same page here, here's how they arrived at the numbers they did. To try and be as fair as possible and to give a more apples to apples comparison, the data is taken from July to June, meaning the holidays we're going to focus on fall right in the middle. And any differences found in those time frames, whether plus or minus, were then averaged over the course of all four holiday seasons being looked at. Remember, we're looking for trends from 2018 through 2021 here. And for the purposes of this comparison, when we're talking about CPH, we're talking about drivers who were hired who became leads during the specified time frame, and not just necessarily those who were hired during that time. Now we did this to try and figure out if the leads coming in at this time were actually quality leads that ended up converting as opposed to the normal method of just assigning the CPH by the actual hire date. It is a little different, I know, but it should give a more accurate picture of what's actually happening with the costs over the holidays. I'll put the whole graphic up here on screen and maybe even leave a link for you down below so you can really focus and check it out. But I'll just hit a few quick highlights for now. For cost per lead, it looks like the most bang for your buck comes from leads away from the actual holidays. Most of the week of and following New Year's. Aside from that, you're probably going to be paying more for leads. Both early November and early December are a touch cheaper, 3 and 4%, but every other week in the exam period, aside from New Year's as I already noted, is at least 4% more expensive, with the week of Christmas being the most costly time, coming in 17% more expensive. For hires, and again, these are the hires from leads that were generated during these times, not just the typical drivers hired at these times. We found pretty much the same thing. Early November and December leads that resulted in hires were cheaper with the first part of November coming in at 12% cheaper. But again, the best bang for your buck is after the holidays with hires that were generated from leads that came in the week after New Year's resulting in 14% less expensive hires than when compared to the rest of the year. So what can we gather from all this? Well, once again, it does seem to put a crack in the argument that November and December are no-goes and terrible times to spend on recruiting. If anything, it does tell us that certain times of November and December can be terrible, but there's also some windows in there where you can really make headway and generate leads and hires at a lower cost than most of the rest of the year. And the week of and after New Year's are still to come this year. So there's still time to get in on those savings. But keep this in mind moving forward too for next year and beyond. And again, if this kind of specific deep drill into data is something you and your fleet are missing, schedule a demo of Strata Strategize today. You can look at cost and hire ratios over specific time frames or even driver types and see how you're doing compared to the competition all right there on the platform. So check it out. Schedule a demo. Subscribe today. 
call it a Christmas present to yourself. Well, that does it for another recruiting roundup, the final recruiting roundup of 2022, in fact. But I will be back next year with another all new recruiting topic for a brand new recruiting roundup. Until then, have a Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays from all of us here at Randall Riley. See you next time. Hey guys, thanks for watching our video. We really hope that it's been useful to you and we hope you come back for more. If you're not already a subscriber, you can do so by clicking that little thing right there so you never miss out on our content. And if you'd like to watch another video, how about this one right here, just for you.